You're a leader on this team, um, and it's not about pretending to be fearless. Like you're leading. It's not. It's about showing that uh, I am scared, and that even though I'm terrified, and I'm going to piss my pants every time I do it, uh, I'm still pushing through, and I'm still making myself a stronger person mentally and physically by doing it. That's where I think the leadership comes from. If you see this guy who's big and fearless and is throwing, you know, these crazy skills and is it just comes easy to him, you become more, in my opinion at least, you become more jealous, envious, and, and discouraged than anything. Because it's like, oh, this guy's doing all this. He's, you know, doing a Yamawaki on high bar and I'm here struggling to do a back off. Like, what's even the point? If you see that the, the chosen leader of your team is struggling just like the rest of you, it's going to make you willing to push and push harder because if he's the leader and he's struggling like I am, like, what's stopping me from pushing forward and also becoming a leader? That's kind of where it is. It's just striving to be the best, pushing each other. We're all in the same place. We all have our own struggles. How can we build upon that?